Hello everyone and welcome to Adam Shar Weekly. So I'm currently working on my new course for Swift UI with Firebase and I came across this particular code. Now it works and you can see everything is fine, but over here you can see we had to do a lot of stuff to get it to a particular style. Now, if I want to reuse the same exact style, meaning a purple button, I have to write all of this code again. So how can we reuse the styles in Swift UI? So let me show you one of the ways you can reuse the styles. We're going to go ahead and create a particular style associated file. So I'm going to go ahead and add a new file and I would call it primary button style and I will go ahead and import Swift UI and I will create a structure calling it the primary button style. Primary button style I'm calling it because that will be the primary style or the style for the primary button, the main button. And then we have button style. Now button style is a protocol. So in order to conform to the protocol, I have to implement make body. And inside the make body, I can use the configuration object to access its press event, label and other stuff related to the button. So now I can say, configuration.label and I can do all of that stuff to the label. So basically I can just copy paste all the code that I had right over here. Pretty cool, right? Let's go ahead and select it and say control I just to make it a little bit more organized. Now I can go back to my login view and instead of using all of this stuff, I can go ahead and simply say dot button style and I can pass in the primary button style. And if you go ahead and refresh it again, you can see that it looks exactly the same. Now, the great thing about this is that if somebody tells you tomorrow that, hey, you know what, the purple color, we don't really need it anymore. We're going to go with the orange for all the primary buttons. Well, I can simply go over here and change this to orange. I hope this is orange. There we go. And we can go back and now resume it and you should be able to see the login button turning to orange. So by creating these reusable styles, we have secured it for future changes because if something changes, we can always go back to our primary button style and change it right here. So hope you will enjoy this tip and start using styles in your applications. If you like this video and want to support my channel, then perhaps you want to check out my Udemy courses. I have a lot of Udemy courses. As you can see, I have Swift UI declarative interfaces for any Apple device. This is a 20 plus hour course. They're only about the $109 price. If you can get it much cheaper, check out the link in the YouTube description. I recently launched another course called Composable Swift UI Architecture really amazing course which tells you a different story about how to implement Swift UI apps using the Redux design pattern. I also have courses on RX Swift, on Combine, machine learning, even Flutter server-side Swift. If you ever wanted to learn about server-side, that's the best course using Vapor 4. If you want to learn about EVM design pattern in Swift UI, I have a course for that and even test-driven development. So, if you do want to support my work, go check out my courses. Thank you so much.